Shaita Shalawam, Kristo Mfoko Sana Kiba O Praise Glory and Honor unto Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Bakapodash. And I'd like to give a double honor for unto the apostles and the elders at Great Milson. And uh, much blessing to you, brothers out there, the brother in truth and in sincerity. Okay. Uh, now, um, you know, this, I was just watching, I watched this, uh, this brother's video. Uh, beware, he so added the book of Enoch, Joshua, Jubilees to, the, uh, to my Bible app. Okay. And, uh, you know, I just wanted to do um, another, you know, just more of a response. Okay. Even though I might have a different title to it. And uh, pretty much. You know, uh, you know, when the Lord brings you to this truth, just stick to what brothers, what the apostles and the elders and the brothers and the them are teaching. Okay, uh, there is no need to wanna go into all these different uh, philosophies and all these different books and uh, all these uh, all these things that are, are outside the scriptures, um, all these things that are are, are, are not being taught. Okay, and this is why a lot of guys they get caught up man, when certain things are uh, when certain things when people start teaching uh, certain things that are contrary to the scriptures, man. Like uh, a lot of brother, a lot of guys got taken by that uh, flat earth movement. Okay, uh, you know because you know it's pretty much you know you know they 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 do, they do not understand the simplicity of this truth, man. Okay, that's why a lot of guys when they come into the truth, you know you see how simple and uh how simple the truth is you know learn the scriptures just go out the hours and bowers and teach me and that's all you have to do man but a lot of guys man they think there's no ways that's the only thing man that you have to do to attain uh salvation man but reality is you know yeah how about shame yeah how shy man make this thing simple man okay there's no need for you to want to go above and beyond what the lord have given us man okay just just stick to what the apostles and the elders teach okay if you're not sure if you know if you know to be even on the safer side if you're not sure you just walk up you know just stick just just watch the apostles man okay watch all their videos and subscribe to their channels and just watch what they teach okay learn from what they teach man okay how they break the scriptures down okay and uh you know you know it's just as simple as that man okay now uh, you you know there's there's a lot of other things man that iso does or what uh that uh, Satan is about in order to uh, to put the stumbling block uh, to start put the stumbling block you know on a, on a, on a, on many people many brothers but those that get taken by those uh, by those things when if anybody gets starts going into the book of Enoch and then they, they get caught up in it man uh, you know then try to teach things out of that book of Enoch when you've never seen any of the apostles or the elders teaching that man you know that was a stumbling block stumbling block to you man okay you got caught in that trap and then you're gonna be removed from the brothers man okay it's you to show that you you're not a man of yahweh bashim yahweh shai man okay now i'm gonna bring up uh, a few scriptures okay and uh i hope they'll be edifying all right let me start off with this scripture here man uh this is deuteronomy 29 and 29 is the secret i believe the brother brought the scripture as well out Okay, so the secret things belong unto Yahweh our power, but unto but but those things which are revealed belong unto us. And a lot of things have been revealed, man. Uh, the breakdown of the scriptures, man. You know, uh, from the apostles, uh, from the men that were he, that were uh, that were here before them. Okay, and today, man, you know, uh, the understanding, man, it, it just gets more and more uh, uh, refined, man. Okay, more clear, man. Okay. So that's it's, it's been given, man. Okay, what we need for salvation, man, has been uh, the Lord has given us, man. Okay, so all these extra things, man. What we wanted to go is there people on Mars or uh, all these questions? Because when you first wake up to this truth, man, you have so many questions, man. Because you're coming up, you're coming up, you're coming from a world that has has a, a different answer for every question, man. Okay, so when you come into the world, man, or if you're a Christian. You a so-called Christian, you come, you you know, you've got so many different questions, man. But the best thing you can do is just to simply just sit down and just watch the videos, man. Watch how the apostles, watch the videos of the apostles, the brothers. You know, that's the best thing you can do, man. And then you know, if uh, you know, if the time is right, man. So you you know, sometimes when you might have questions in your mind, and the spirit, man, the spirit will lead you to uh to the answers, man. 
okay to a video of uh, of a brother breaking the uh, breaking it down for you man okay okay all you gotta do is just trust in the lord man okay trust in yahweh Hashem, yahweh shai you know that you're gonna be led uh to the answers that you have man uh, um, certain questions man certain questions uh, uh, certain questions are not necessary man okay certain questions certain questions trying to find the answer to certain things man it's not necessary man especially when you're fully in you okay it says unto our children forever that we may do all the ways of, the, of this law man okay so certain things man belong to the lord man okay and then the things which the lord has revealed to us the lord has revealed to us all right this is uh psalms 119 and 9 it says uh wherewithal shall a young man cleanse his way by taking heed unto by by, te- by taking heed there to there to according to their word okay so how do when you woke up man how to have how to you know that's that's a form of baptism man because uh, if you look up the word baptism it means that uh, to be immersed to be immersed okay to be completely immersed in water man okay which is uh the baptism true bapt you know which is real baptism man is uh when you, you know when you are uh, when you're completely immersed into the scriptures man okay when they take over your your entire life man okay you, you become all about the scriptures man okay all about this word man okay since where we for sure a young man cleans his ways by taking it there to according to that word man and the lord have given us uh, have given us teachers in order to give us the understanding of what the scriptures are okay so it's always best you just stick to what our our, our teachers have always been have always been teaching man okay because they are the men of yahweh bashim yahweh shai all right uh the next precept is uh second uh, peter's two and one and it says uh wherefore laying aside all malice and all gall and all hypocrisies and envies and all evil speakings okay good morning salaki it says as newborn babes okay because when when you when you when you wake up into from uh, into this truth man you're a baby man okay you're a newborn baby man okay you're supposed to you're supposed to come uh, that's the best way to come into this truth man knowing knowing for knowing not having uh, uh like a child a child does not know anything okay and that's how you come into this truth man like a child man someone who does not know anything man you just simply quiet you just simply sit there quietly okay and uh learn man okay he says as newborn babes desire the sincere milk of the word man okay desire the sincere milk of the word okay the, the basics okay the basics uh the simple breakdowns okay uh you know just just little things like that man and then as, as time as, as time goes by he says that he may grow thereby and as time goes by man you start to have to, uh, to get more understanding on certain things okay because you cannot just sit down in one day or in one week and learn or and learn uh, and learn this book man okay it takes time man okay you might have read the you might have read the bible a few times man before you came to the truth man but the reality is man you're not ready to understand it okay it says uh it says that you may grow thereby so you begin with the basics okay and then as time goes by man you start to uh, add on to your understanding okay you start to grow in this knowledge man okay according to what uh according to what what gets taught man you stick and you stick to uh to the doctrine that's been given to you okay it's another precept james 1 and 21 and it says wherefore lay apart all filthiness and superfluity of naughtiness man and receive with meekness to be meek is to be one man to be humble man okay to, to somebody of uh, somebody who's uh you know somebody you know putting pride aside man all right he said and receive with meekness the engrafted word which is able to save your, uh, to save to save your souls man okay everybody has the bible in that everybody has the bible in their houses okay but they do not have the and they, they do not have the word which is able to save their souls man they do not have the true understanding of the scriptures man all right um bring up this couple more precepts okay so first timothy 4 and 16 he says take take heed unto thyself and unto the doctrine okay continue in them in what in the doctrine that you have been taught that you have been taught okay he says for in doing this thou shalt both save thyself so from the doctrine that you've, you've you've been taught you will save yourself and save them that hear thee so from the same doctrine which you have been taught you'll be able to save your soul and then you'll be able to save uh, those that you teach as well man okay if they take heed to the doctrine as well man as long as you, you deliver it the same way that it's been delivered to you 
okay the correct way man okay he says uh, for in doing for in doing this thou shalt both save thyself and them that hear thee all right um it's another precept he says uh uh, 2 Timothy 3 and 14 says, But continue thou in the things which thou hast learned, and hast been assured of. Okay, you've learned from the, from our apostles, man. Okay, if you, if you, if, if you, if you, if you, if you have faith, man, you understand that the apostles, man, that, that we have today are the ones whom the Lord have chosen in order to bring uh, Israel, in order to bring the elect of Israel back to the kingdom, man. Okay? And this is why they are so uh, diligent in the work that they're doing. And their work, the work that they do shows that they are those men. Okay, says, but continue thou in the, in the things that thou hast learned and hast been assured of, knowing, knowing whom thou hast learned them. Okay, and this is why we give double honors and uh, to our apostles, man. Okay, but knowing the fact that they're doing now, uh, Yahweh Bashim Yahashai's work. Okay, and you know it's a. Uh, It's through this through this word or through this uh, uh doctrine let me say which the apostles have taught us man that's the word uh, that that uh that begot us back to yahweh bashim yahweh shai man that's what brought us back to our nationality man all right he says and that from a child thou hast known the holy scriptures which are able to make thee wise unto salvation through faith in which which is in yahweh in, in yahweh shai man Right, so when we come, when we come, when we, when, you know, when we wake up to this truth, man, we, are, we become what as babies, man, a child, man, and we start to grow, man. Okay. So you know, you know, you're, you know, you're not the age that uh, you are, man, on your on your on your driver's license or your passport, man. Okay, your your age is, is according to, uh, 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 you know, your, your length in this knowledge, man. Okay, so we are all babies, really, man. All right. Um, can I get this last precept? Um. This is the Galatians 1 and, and, and 6. It says, I marvel that ye are soon removed from him that called you into the grace of Yahweh Shai unto another gospel. Okay, so do not move from the from the gospel that you gets taught to you, man. Okay, do not move from the doctrine that gets taught to you. Okay, stick to what you have been taught, man. Okay, stick to what gets taught. Okay, teach only what you have learned from the apostles, man. Okay, don't go above and beyond, man. Trying to go into other books. Okay, trying to be the mighty Hebrew breakdown, whatever the hell you wanna be, man. Okay, just stick to what gets taught, man. Okay, just if you do, just even just the basics, man. Just teaching the basics, man, is 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 is, uh, is good enough. All right, which is not another, but there be some that trouble you and will pervert the gospel of Yahweh Shai, man. There's been ma- there's been many guys, man, that try to pervert the gospel of Yahweh Shai, man. Okay, trying to bring something else. That I would never, that uh, even the apostles man, don't teach me. Okay, the flat earth doctrine. This guy is from China. Uh, this guy is now who trying to get rid of the 12 tribe, uh, the 12 tribe sign. Okay, uh, changing up, changing everything that they learned. Okay, saying that uh, this the missiles, the uh, uh, the missiles are not in the Bible, in the scriptures. Uh, the chariots are not are not in the scriptures. Okay, and then look at this what uh, the apostle say. The apostle Paul says, man, he says, but though we or an angel from heaven preach any other gospel unto you than that which he have that he says but though we okay even even so if that's how that's how sure that doctrine was which was taught uh, that which was taught man to the point that he said even if, if they were to come back and start teaching contrary to what that what was what was taught to you he says but though we or an angel from heaven even an angel from heaven preach any other gospel unto you than that which we have preached unto you because it was a sure doctrine man. okay that's why back in the uh uh uh, uh, uh where is that okay back in uh, first, uh first second timothy 3 and 14 it says uh uh which thou hast learned and has been assured of man okay it was assured it was a sure doctrine man Okay, says, but that, but, but uh, back to Galatians one and eight, it says, but though we or an angel from heaven preach any other gospel unto you than that which we have preached unto you, let them be accursed, man. 
okay so anybody teaches anything else other than what gets taught them and let them be a guest man okay so you know a curse will come out on you man you start teaching anything else contrary to what gets taught man it says as we said as we said before so say i say now again if any man if any man preach any other gospel unto you than that you have received let him be a case man so he, he repeats his statement man okay that's how important the situation uh, that's how important that is man okay so stick to what you've been taught man okay there is no need all these things even if, if you if, if you go a bible app or whatever you start seeing these things start popping up in the bible app whatever man just ignore it ignore them man okay especially when you first uh, when you first come into the truth man okay <clears throat> when you first come in truth man just watch the video man <clears throat> There is no need to uh to start uh confusing yourself man otherwise the reality is man if you if you know if uh you start going into all these different other things which are above your strength and you get taken by them and most likely man you know you were never meant to be a part of this in the first place man okay anyway uh that's just my little response to uh this brother's video which i watched here okay and look at that at the bottom there um enoch joshua jubilees man okay you you know even in the regular bible you don't get that man okay so it's so it's not a uh, so confusion uh to anybody that's into the bible man okay and it's gonna be a, to best believe this will be a stumbling block or to many many people man because you know when iso iso and the scholars when they put something out there man a lot of guys man you know they believe iso man he's a he's a you know he's the one with the answers man okay so they you know if we tell them don't go into these things man you know they are they are they are uh, their uh what you call that um their attitude is you know do you guys know more than these scholars okay but anyway uh stick to what you've been taught man okay and i'll say shalom